According to a senior Moscow official, Russian troops and security forces successfully suppressed an alleged cross-border raid from Ukraine on Tuesday, resulting in the reported deaths of over 70 attackers after a 24-hour battle. Moscow attributed the raid, which began on Monday, to Ukrainian military saboteurs. Kyiv, on the other hand, portrayed it as an uprising against the Kremlin led by Russian partisans. The conflicting narratives make it difficult to ascertain the true nature of the attack or the motives behind it, the Associated Press reported. Now the confrontation occurred in the Belgrade region, which is situated approximately 45 miles north of the city of Kharkiv, which is located in eastern Ukraine. Now this region serves as a key Russian military hub. It houses fuel and ammunition depots. While Russia has previously accused Ukrainian saboteurs of incursions, this incident marked the first time that the counter-operation against such a raid had extended into a second day. The incident proved to be an embarrassment for the Kremlin, and it underscored the challenges that Moscow faces in its protracted invasion of Ukraine. Now, the Russian Defense Ministry spokesman, Igor Koneshenkov, asserted that the armed attackers were repelled by local troops and as well as through airstrikes and artillery fire. Quote, the remaining nationalists were pushed back into Ukrainian territory, where they continued to be targeted until they were completely eliminated, stated Konashenkov. Although he did not provide any evidence to support his claims, he made no mention of Russian casualties.